What is going on YouTube? Foxy here, coming to you guys today with a brand new video, and we're finally making a video on the Vendetta Sniper, so I hope you guys do enjoy. We're going to look at the trigger finger, or my trigger finger at least, and uh, we're just going to take a look at this weapon and just hopefully get some awesome moments. So I hope you guys do enjoy. If you guys do, make sure you guys leave a like down below. Subscribe, turn on notifications. We are on the road to 100,000 subscribers, so if you guys could push that subscribe button, that'd be greatly appreciated. Use code FOXY on gfield.com for 10% off your order. Follow all my social medias down in the description below. My Twitter, my Twitch, my Instagram, my public Discord server. And without further ado, let's go, bros. Oh, well. So this Vendetta, right? The Vendetta Sniper. We got this in the last event, I'm pretty sure. I can't remember which event it was, honestly. The Vendetta Sniper is actually not that bad. It's a one-shot headshot. It's pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. I really liked using this. It was really easy to get diamond camo as well. And I mean, obviously, because like when you when when you just like spam a bunch and you know not die like that, of course, because you know you guys probably don't suck at the game like I do. When you spam it a bunch and you can just get a headshot, we got all our headshots done in hardcore. Yeah, we, we got them done in hardcore. I'm pretty sure. Oh fuck, I suck ass. All right, so the Vendetta Sniper was released in the last event. It was actually in the tiers, which was awesome. I thought because it was finally a weapon that we got in the tiers instead of you know being behind a supply drop, which really sucks actually. That's one. There's another one. There's no fire rate cap on this gun. At least I think. I don't believe that there's a fire rate cap on this gun. And that's really cool because I know that they kind of gave a fire rate cap to the DMR and all the other guns except maybe like the Strife pistol or whatever, I'm pretty sure. But even then, I, I can't, I honestly don't know. Um, I'm just kind of spewing off shit. <laughs> but it's nice to see that they brought a rifle into the game that has no cap. And I know in Black Ops 3, there was the 1911 pistol that had no cap, but I've missed a rifle having no cap. And it really reminds me of the FAL from BO2. But I know that's weird to say, considering that the rifle from BO2 is a semi-automatic rifle, and this is a sniper rifle. I don't know, man. It just really performs, in, in my opinion, because it's got no fire rate cap, it really performs like the FAL from BO2. Let's see, they should spawn down there. I'm kind of waiting for more to pop up. Two. There we go. There's another one. It's bloodthirsty. There we go. There's another one. It's a UAV. I don't have any higher streaks on except a fucking Hellstorm missile. Keep popping out. Just keep popping out. They're not going to run this way. They're going to run the other way. Never mind. Someone's going to run this way. And of course I missed. No. Oh my god. Holy shit. I just want to get a hellstorm. Just let's let me, just let me get a fucking hellstorm. We got 17 bullets in this thing. No, dude. Oh my god. I swear to God, if I die, I'm gonna be pissed. There we go. There we go. Hellstorm missile. Now I'm running a holographic sight on this because, I, I mean, I would run a dual zoom. But at the same time, or whatever sight there is for this gun, wow, he was sitting in the corner with a fucking ballistic knife. Nice. I would run a different sight on this, but the holographic sight just works, in my opinion, because there is no red dot sight for this gun. So we're just going to make do with what we got. Thank you. There's two piece. I'm actually going to move up real quick. Nice. <laughs> Nice. Ah, how you like them knives, boy? You, what? You died a lot. <laughs> All right, so we're also playing bare bones team deathmatch, and I'm hopefully knock on wood, I don't run into any parties because it's double XP weekend. So there's double XP in everything, double weapon X XP, double you know, just regular double XP. Like there's double XP everywhere. You get double XP. You get double XP, and you get double XP. Alright guys, so let me know down in the comments, what gun from a previous Call of Duty does the Vendetta Sniper Rifle remind you of? Personally, with me, like I said before, it reminds me of the FAL, but so I think someone pointed out one time that it reminds them of the M14 from Black Ops 3, and I can definitely see that. Get headshotted there, buddy. So it's double XP weekend, which means everyone and their mom are sweating their fucking balls off right now. And thankfully, I haven't run into some super sweaty lobbies yet, but I'm sure we will. You know, you always know we will. Oh, there, there was a little bit of a lag spike. That's right. The last time I played this game, it was laggy as hell. I, get, I kept having lag spikes out of the ass, bro. 
Just, oh, it was unbearable. It was fucking awful. No! Ah, my side fat. Got shot in my side fat. It's it's tragic. Don't you hate it when you get shot in your side fat? I I hate it so much. My side fat, my back fat, it's just, it's just fucking atrocious. So there's been rumors that have come out that Modern Warfare won't have three lane maps. And that's pretty awesome. Well, I mean, they will have three lane maps, but like not all the maps in the game are three lanes. Which is awesome! The only thing that I'm hoping for is that it's not like Ghosts, where the maps are too big. And then also, I hope it's not like Ghost in the sense that the maps are uh, too too campy. You know, there's not. I hope that there's not thermal sight on every single gun like Ghost because Ghost had that. And then you had people sitting in buildings all the time, and they would just sit there and wait for people to show up in their thermal sight, and then they would just kill them. That's like that's like insane to me. All right, so I have a question. Who thought this map was a good idea? I really want to know. I want to know who thought this map was a good idea because I love the outside view. I love the skybox of this map, honestly. I really do. But I gotta say, this map inside is fucking dreadful. It's Garbo Squarbo, dude. If this was like an outside map mainly, I wouldn't really have a problem with it. But it's not. <laughs> oh, there's two. Dude, I can't see anybody! There we go. It's been a while since we've had double XP in Black Ops 4, so if you guys definitely still play this game, make sure you guys take advantage of it. We don't get these that often, which is kind of surprising to me. It's weird to me how they don't have a Weekend Warfare playlist for this game either, considering that, you know, Modern Warfare Remastered had one, and I'm pretty sure that World War II had Weekend Warfare playlists as well. I can't remember exactly, but I'm pretty sure they did. There we go, there's another one. There's another. But yeah, it's odd that there's no Weekend Warfare playlist to give us double XP or like that there's at least one double XP playlist a weekend, you know, and it doesn't have to be fan favorite game modes every single time, you know? Actually gonna flank. Uh, no, actually we're not. I have a feeling that they're still gonna spawn back here. Look, there's a guy. Guys, let me know down in the comments. What's your favorite sniper rifle in Black Ops 4? Yo, these spawns are so trash. How did I knew? How did I know that was gonna happen? Like, how did I know that we that I was gonna spawn back here and then it was gonna spawn the entire team back here? Like, that's so garbage, bro. Oh, there's another headshot. You see how easy it is to get headshots in this game? Or I mean, well, with this gun at least, because it's a one-shot kill to the head. Oof. We're on a merciless. No, no, fuck, dude. I, it, it, whether it doesn't matter what game it is, I'm always gonna choke streaks and I'm always gonna suck ass. Like that, that's just all there is to it. So we put a dual zoom scope on. I just wanted to see what it would be like, honestly. This guy's running body armor. I saw it. You little bastard. Get your dumbass back here. Yep. Double kill. That's a nice double kill. Here we go. Uh, I definitely just got some pull. That's why. There we go. There's a guy. He's dead. Dead. I tell you. Hey, what's up there, buddy? God damn, my aim is fucking just pitiful. Interesting. Well, there's somebody. Hey, you're dead. Nope. Okay, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, man. Headshot city. There we go there, bros. Uh, I, I'm, I'm very low on health, though, so I should probably hide. Let's regen our health here. Oh, there's a nice little headshot. You're donezo. Donezo bonzo. Oh, and I didn't even see him. A really cool thing about the Vendetta Sniper is that you can do site like on-site reloading, kind of similar to how it's going to be in Modern Warfare. Uh, no, oh my God, I almost said Modern Warfare Remastered. I meant Modern Warfare 2019, where you can aim down your sight, but you can also reload. So like that's super cool. My mesh mines are still up there. Nope, you're done with the headshot there, Nate the Great. You ain't great. You're dead. That's what you are. Oh, there's a guy. Yep, that's right. We're going to call in the dog right now. Because fuck your feelings, that's why. Honestly, this this sniper rifle is better than the M21, or whatever you want to call it. The, I don't know. I can't remember what it's called. I, I don't play this game enough to know the weapons and shit like that. I think it's like the... I, honestly, I completely forget, to be perfectly honest with you guys. Oh my god. 
whenever the automatic, not, it's not automatic, but the semi-automatic, non-bolt action sniper rifle is. Aha! I got him with the mesh mine. But guys, what do you all think of the Vendetta sniper rifle? Do you guys like it? I really wish they had put a different weapon in the tiers. Like, if they put the Peacekeeper in the tiers, I would have been cool with that. But, like, they put this in the tiers, but then that would have had two sniper rifles in the t in the supply drops. So, like, they couldn't have done that. So, like, even the Locust, but the Locust sucks balls. So, you know, yeah, they, they couldn't have done that either. They had to put at least some type of decent weapon in the in the tiers i mean personally okay yeah that's fucking great yeah you guys are really gonna like the content that's coming to the channel really soon you know I, I got like a lot of content that i want to make and no a lot of content that i'm about to make is about to be really really good it's really a lot of variety in it you know since we do multi-cod on this channel and things like that so you know it's gonna be awesome and then especially with the multiplayer reveal for modern warfare coming out on august 1st that'll be really awesome and we won the game let's go baby thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys later Goodbye.